this is the drawstring tassel backpack so tonight is movie night and i'm showing you how i packed it out uh, for movie night this thing holds an obscene amount of stuff for a relatively i'm going to back up so you can appreciate it mm -hmm. for a relatively small profile bag and look at it sideways like this is holding a lot of stuff and i'm actually going to put some more stuff in here before we leave for movie night and i'm also really hoping that it cools down because it is some kind of hot for september um okay so this one is unlike anything Suzette's ever done. It's a drawstring style backpack. She has done fringe before, but not on a backpack. Uh, not that I know of anyways. And so this is like long awaited. People are dying for it. It's amazing. It's so super cute. Um, there's no pockets or anything on the exterior. And you'll notice that at first I used to, if you watch the nuts and bolts, which is shows the measurements of the bag, I took my fish hook keychain and I hung it from the interior but I actually have started carrying it like this like I take my keys and I hook them here to this little loop that holds the um, backpack straps and I find like for me that's really easy so keys on the exterior uh, otherwise it has a really clean exterior these are the straps for the backpack pull them at the same time so that they stay the same length and you don't have one that's like longer than the other it has these which are not adjustable and this is the top grab handle, super nice for if you're getting out of your car, you're in the driver's seat and you wanna get this thing. It's really nice to have the top handles. I know this is like probably the number one feature of Love 41 bags that people like and comment on. Um, and I'll say incidentally, this is actually how I carry the bag by the top handles. Um, I actually carry it a lot like this and I find it to be super duper comfortable. Um, I don't know, I just like it. It just feels comfortable to me, I get stopped all the time like what is that who makes that bag uh, and I'm all too happy to talk about it um anyway so that's how I carry the bag most of the time I just I don't know I like carrying it like that and like sort of swinging it back and forth in this silly way so the tassels uh, dance um, but primarily it is a backpack but I want to show you before I go backpack mode all the things that I've put in here um, and because I'm going out and because I didn't pull it into backpack mode I didn't cinch the top but I'm gonna show you what's in there first um, and it is movie night, so it's kind of that's what I'm bringing. And it's also like Love 41 extravaganza. So let me start with this. This, they don't have it anymore, so I don't want to torture you because it's super cute. And it's one of our favorite blankets uh, that we got from Love 41. And I got this when she had, um, she, the, gosh, I want to say this was like, I don't know, 2016 or 2017. You guys probably know better than me. She had a, um, she had a mystery box. For mother's day and this was in there and i love 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 and adore this blanket and so this is coming with us to movie night and this is what we're going to use um on the grass suzette if you're watching i really hope you do another mystery box because i missed the last one and i'm so bummed um but anyways so that's what fits in this thing which is really nice and then i have her which is i kind of call this like the love 41 starter kit this is her cosmetic bag but i actually use it a lot as a lunch purse or as a weekend purse um, I put odds and ends in there that we might need because I don't know if the kid's going to start sneezing because we're in the grass or if I'm going to start sneezing because we're in the grass. Um, so I put sort of like medical-ish stuff in here. Um, and you could obviously put makeup, but I just put like medical stuff for us tonight uh, for the movies. And that felt really well, really well in here. And then I have this, which is like... Advil, chapstick, sunscreen. I never leave home without this. This is her Love 41. It's actually for essential oils. I don't even have essential oils, but I use it all the time and I'll show you. Like, see, I put like all these little lotions and stuff in there. And then all the medicines like Tylenol and sore throat drops, those are all at the bottom. I'm kind of surprised at how much went in here. This one, which um, mentally I'm hoping to move on from because I never look at the content, so I really don't need to be carrying it around anymore. But this is from the sister company, uh, Saddleback. This is their fly fishing wallet that I use as a wallet to house like my Starbucks gift card and my frequent flyer whatever. Don't really know that I need to carry it, but it's so cute and like you could do this with it. So I have it all the time. I also never leave home without it because I feel just sort of like married to it. So that's in there. And then I have of course sunglasses because even though it's a night movie and it's supposed to start it when the sun goes down, I feel like with the end of summer, there's going to be still some light um, and it's late already and look how bright it is still and then this is my wallet where I keep like the things I actually do use so I keep like cash driver's license ATM card all that stuff in there and this one actually lives most of the time but this time I threw everything in because I'm like 
like, we got to get this show on the road. Um, most of the time it lives here in their single hanging pocket. Um, and I also put my phone in here. This is actually my daughter's phone. It doesn't work as a phone phone, but it's great for her because she loves to take photos. She's like very artistic. So I gave her my old phone and um, it actually holds my normal phone too. I have a Samsung Galaxy S7. This is an old one. This is like the 4G Lite. Um, but that fits really well in there. And you could also, I'll show you, you could also put your keys in there if you wanted to, clunky keys. Um, or if you wanted to do this, you could slip your keys in there and you'd still have this available for your phone. Um, and let me put this back in here. And let me do this for you. Because I want to show you a couple other things. So the first is that it's got the two straps here. And I want to make a comment that if you're short, and by that I mean I'm short, I'm 5'2", you cannot hold this bag like this and let it hang by your side. Because the tassels, these tassels will be okay but these long ones will drag. So I measured from like sort of here to the longest tassel. This is like 31 inches. So you can measure if you, you know, you could see like, can you hold this bag like this at your side and not have the tassels drag? Um, so, but if you're 5'2", definitely you cannot do that. I suppose you could pop these out and then maybe you could make a go of it, but it might look a bit silly. But anyways, let me show you backpack mode. This bag is still pretty new for me, so a couple of things one you can see that like you still got to break it in you still got to sort of work with the leather to get the cinch sort of nice and loose um and for a fairly new bag i did that actually really easily but as you own the bag and break the leather in uh, and wear it and it gets a sort of beautiful sheen and patina you'll notice that this will get easier and easier with time but i'm going to show it to you on just so you can see what that looks like Um, it's really comfortable on and you will get stopped and then the other thing too I want to mention to you is you can make it as tight as you want by sort of doing this once it's on because I like my backpacks on really snug and so I kind of like that you can grab these and sort of yank down and it sort of tightens the backpack once it's on um, and it stays really nice to your back a lot of times when you have a backpack you'll notice this like it sort of falls away at the top and then the bottom sort of is the only part touching. This one's really nice because it it touches you from the top to the bottom, so it just feels secure with it on. Um, but that's it. It's a simple, simple backpack and bag, but what makes it really sing are these amazing tassels. Um, and I think there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven in the center, one on either side, so there's nine. They are gorgeous and amazing. Um, and when I see this, it makes me want to buy one of her tassels, her sold standalone tassels, so I can add it to one of my bags. But give it a shot. I love, love, love this bag. I don't have, I was kind of thinking like, did I have a version 2.0? And the only thing that kind of came to mind was maybe a pocket sort of like here in the back. And the reason I say sort of here in the back is because, and let me do backpack mode again so you can sort of see what I'm saying. And I'm, I hesitated to even say version 2.0 because I'm trying to get away from being that person. But let's be honest, I'm not there yet. And that person is the person that checks their phone all the time, either out of habit or necessity, whatever it is, you know who you are. Um, and so I would have appreciated the opportunity to get to my phone without taking the bag off. So I was thinking if there was a back pocket, sort of like this, I could take it off, grab my phone and sort of put it back. Um, and so that's my only thing is maybe a really small, slim, discreet pocket on the back side of the bag to tuck my phone in. Um, so that's it. This is the Love 41 drawstring tassel backpack. It's my companion for movie night. Um, it's been my companion at beach day. It's just your easy, fun weekend bag. If you don't work in a super formal corporate setting, you could definitely get your laptop in here. Um, and that is it. If you have any questions, let me know. Thank you so much for watching.